Yo, 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 YouTube. Today's video is about an amazing new tool eBay is launching at the end of this month to help us speed up our listings. Check this out. All right, check this out. Sports Collectors Daily reported this yesterday. eBay has a new scanning tool that will be employed at the end of this month. Uh, unfortunately, not for sports cards yet. It's just going to be for gaming cards. However, it sounds like they intend to bring it to sports cards in the near future. I'm sure they're starting with the gaming cards because it's probably easier and quicker to identify the art on those cards. Nevertheless, as long as it comes to sport cards, I think it will really help listing times and make eBay that much more smoother and efficient. We'll have to see how well it does on things like parallels and short prints and, you know, stuff like that, that um, is a, probably a little bit more complicated than just getting a picture of what the card is. The tool is definitely described as being simple enough. It looks like you're going to use your mobile app, either iOS or Android, and then eBay will, the back end will fill in all the extra listing stuff you would normally have to put in, you know, year, set, card description, player, that kind of thing. I'm guessing you might have to add a condition, quantities, you know, things like that that wouldn't show up in a scanning setting. Um, so more to come on that. It, it, it's kind of nice this doesn't go to sports cards right away because we can kind of see how it works first. eBay made a statement on this as well. Um, among our 185 million shoppers around the world, we've seen unparalleled demand for trading cards over the past year, with 4 million more sold than the year prior, uh, said Nicole Colombo. She's the head of trading cards and collectibles at eBay. We're actively listening to our growing community and invest in new enhancements, including leveraging computer vision technology and building a robust trading card catalog. Our new listing feature will not only create a faster and more convenient experience for our sellers, but will also provide more robust trading card inventory for shoppers, all while ensuring that the information in card listings is more accurate. That would be nice. Here's how the step-by-step -step process will work. So in step one, in the eBay app, you'd start your listing with a game name. So this is obviously for collectible games. Once prompted, select tap to search with your camera. Step two, point the camera at the card. Step three, select the match of the card. And then it's that easy. I guess you would just, it will preload everything once you select that card. So I don't know how that exactly that's going to work with cards that aren't in the database. I'm guessing you just wouldn't be able to automatically load them then. I think you would just choose whatever card is the closest match and then just edit whatever isn't the same as your card. So, you know, the, the serial numbering, the parallel version, something like that. So eBay makes the claim that th this will help you create a listing in half the time. Um, maybe we'll have to see. They haven't released a specific date or month that expects to sp expand this option to sports cards. Um, but sports collectors daily speculates that summer, or early fall would be a reasonable time frame. A rollout at the national might happen as well. I can tell you for me, this sounds like something extremely promising. I list a ton of cards and I'm actually, as you've seen in a prior video, I'm looking to expand my store since I have 50,000 fixed listings I can take advantage of and build a lot of that inventory out. Listing is by far the least fun part, um, time consuming. There's spelling errors that you have to correct, there's listing errors, there's, you have to go in and put in the year and the product and the description, if it's graded, who graded it, what grade it is, serial numbers, I mean, there's just tons and tons and tons of stuff that if you want to have a really good, robust, correct listing, um, there's a lot of work. So if this takes out 
even half of that work, 40% of that work, that would be a big boost. So I'm really looking forward to it. Um, I want to know what you think. Please leave a comment and let me know if this is something that you think you could take advantage of. I personally do all of my listings with my phone. So having it built into the app with Android and Apple, logically you would be using your phone to scan the image anyway. So having the listing right in the app makes a lot of sense to me. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a, a like and ring the bell if you would like notifications of future videos. Otherwise, we'll see you again soon.